going on guys, it's Ashley here, welcome back to another Wolves video. Today I'm going to be giving my preview for today's game against Sunderland at Molyneux. Now, it's one of those games again that it's definitely winnable. It's definitely winnable. No offence to Sunderland, but they're not the greatest of teams in the championship this season. In fact, in fact, they're one of the worst this season. Um, uh, and they've come down from the they've come down from the Premier League, uh, and and they they've turned out in the Championship to be one of the worst. They're struggling in the relegation places, a bit like Bolton as well, uh, who we thrashed five one a couple of weeks ago, and I made a vlog for um, when I went to that game. Um, Bol Bolton, um, Bolton have managed to. Uh, make their way out of the relegation zone um, as, as I know of uh, they may have dropped back into it um, but as I know of they are they have climbed out of the relegation zone um, and the, the, the steadily um, making their way up uh, the championship but as for Sunderland they're, they're, like, they keep on struggling they keep on struggling. They can't seem. They can't seem to find a win anywhere. They can't seem to find a win um, anywhere. And and um, yeah, when when they when they do win, when they do win, it's only it's only really false false hope, really. As uh, as the next week they go and pretty much lose again. So. It's it, it's it's false hope whenever they win, really. But um, coming to Mon you, um, I I don't expect they'll have much confidence coming to Mon you since obviously coming into this, uh, they're they're realising they're playing the top of the championship here. Uh, so I don't think they'll come to Mon you with confidence. Um, they might do because they they obviously they might want to cause an upset, but but I, I don't think I honestly don't think uh, that they'll really have a chance. Um, I, don't, I also don't think they'll really have a chance of uh, uh, of, of getting uh, anything from this game. Really, uh, they'll be lucky to come away with a point. Um, as uh, if, if if we played. Um, like we did in, in the second half against Birmingham, then they might have a chance. But obviously, after that second half performance, um, when the full time whistle blew and they went into the changing rooms, um, I bet, uh, Nuno would have had some words to say after that performance in the second half. It was a little bit flat on Monday, um, a little bit flat in the second half on Monday. Uh, against Birmingham, but um, I bet that I've uh, been told that that kind of performance is not acceptable, um, and uh, and we've got to uh, strive for better performances because obviously um, a couple of weeks ago now, uh, I think Nuno, Nuno said uh, that uh, they wanted um, better home performances, so. Uh, so, so obviously, uh, obviously another chance, um, another chance um, to impress, and another chance to um, to uh, improve on those home performances, um, as we are at home, obviously, to Sunderland today. So, I think it's, it is going to be a win. I think it is going to be a win today. Um, fingers crossed. Hopefully, we don't play like we did in the second half against Blues on on Monday. Um, because that that was that was quite flat, really. That was quite flat. We had um, we had one chance with Helder Costa in the second half. We should have took it. Too much uh, too much footwork and um, and uh, stop Bell. Stop Bell saved it, but. I think we're gonna. Uh, I think it's gonna be a routine win today. A routine win against Sunderland, who can't seem to win at the moment. They can't really seem to win. They lost 3-1 against Reading, 
uh, last week. Uh, they, they lost 3-1 against Reading, and um, who, who are also struggling uh, down uh, in the bottom half of the championship. Uh, so it, it's. I think it's going to be. Uh, I'm going to go for three-one. I think we're going to go. I think we're going to go three-nil up, and then we're going to concede a goal late on. That is what I'm going to predict. Uh, we're going to concede a goal late on, uh, but it won't really matter because it's late on, so we've won the game anyway. So I'm going to go for a 3-1 win. Um, and uh, yeah, hopefully it's going to be a positive review tomorrow. Um, so uh, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow uh, with a review of the Sunderland game. Until then, goodbye guys!